Wait! Alive! You captured it alive! What are you doing? <sighs> if we can catch one, we can catch more, males and females. Tie them up, feed them. Soon we would have our own herd, and then... And then we wouldn't have to hunt them anymore. Exactly, and there will always be meat for the clan. You are truly wise, Bakur. This would be... What fool dares to kill my beast? Not your beast, caveman. Our beast. Come and get it. Oh. <laughs> Come on! Drop it! Oh, no, I won't. I pick and you eat it all? No way. Now give me this. Whoever strikes next goes without meat. Yeah! Just fruit. <laughs> I'll kill you, Rahan! I'll kill you! I'll kill you! <laughs> he always says it three times. Hmm? He... He ate out of my hand. Six families have decided to leave the village. We mean to settle somewhere beyond the Grey Mountains, but we wanted to ask you. Well? Well, Rahan, are you wiser than they are? Answer me. I understand their wish to live in peace, but the cold season is coming. You'd have trouble crossing the mountain with old people and children. Aha! Uh -huh. But there is another way we can go. We? Oui. We can go around the mountain by taking the river. In canoes? No, just one canoe. A single canoe with a sail. Big enough to take everyone. Of course. That would be just a... Then make it very big. Did you hear what I heard? He finally decided to go. It took the life of a reindeer for him to know the importance of peace. Whoa. Yesterday, it was everyone for themselves, but today... Yes. Work brings us together. Then again, so does war. War. You know you don't believe in war anymore. No, you have made the right choice, Bakor. The least painful one, but not the most honorable. If we run from Enoch... If you run from Enoch, you will destroy him. He is a war chief, not a clan chief. When he has no enemies to fight, he will be nothing. But you... Your people will never forget what you did for them. They do, but as you're not a bear... Ah! Keep your monkey away from my baby. I mean it. It will be...
this big. I've never seen a canoe like it. What is it for? Well, I know that Rahan is working with them. They will come by the river where we are most vulnerable. The canoe will leave many warriors at the foot of our village. Old folk, children, no one will be safe. I warned you of Rahan's evil genius. Such horrors will befall our people if you do not act now. I shall destroy this canoe before it ever reaches the water. You have a brave's heart, Enoch the Wolf. As for those cave dogs, I'll slaughter as many as I can. That's not a way to be on the watch. I'll climb and tear them down from the top. The longer the vines, the more useful they'll be. I know what you intended to do, but that was not a clever move, was it? We know what you're up to, and all we've got to fight you is our courage. Maybe you should mix it with some brains. Hey! Huh? Jaro! Kill him! But, but, if I kill him, we'll never get out of here alive. He's smarter. You should listen to him. Hey! Bakor, no! The canoe is safe. Let them go. <sighs> Ah, Enoch saw it in the flames of the future. You're going to sail up the river and attack our village. Drac's fire does not show the future, but only what Drac wants you to see. But then, why are you building this canoe? The cave dwellers are tired of all the bloodshed and hatred. That canoe will take all of us far from here to another territory where we can finally live in peace. The wolves will soon be alone on this land where so much blood has been spilled. Uh, alone? Like flies on a rotting carcass. Now go, tell Enoch and Drac. <laughs> All the wolves. The kick wasn't necessary. Perhaps it wasn't. Then again, if we only do what is necessary, we would be just like animals. <laughs> Yay! We won! The cave dwellers are leaving! The Great Valley is ours! Yay! You wish to speak to me? The cave dwellers prefer to flee rather than defend their honor. But you... I will watch those cowards sail down the river while I burn down their huts. Winter will spread its white coat over the ashes. When the green season returns, it will be as if the cave dwellers had never existed. So... The chief of the Wolf Clan lets the woman who betrayed him go free. And the man that had humiliated him so many times as well. A charm for you? Well, it doesn't have to be a charm. Could be a potion or something. Because, see, traveling on water always makes me... You know, well, you don't want to know. But believe me, it's disgusting. They'll throw me overboard for sure. You don't need to worry about that. You'll give me something? Oh. No, because you won't be going. I saw it in the clouds. Well, uh... Clouds? Uh, maybe you shouldn't look at them so much. Look at me, because... Wait, the Great Valley with all the... Pew, pew. 
I've had enough. So, no offense, but your clouds, they'll just have to go back to Cloud Cuckoo Land. Sorry, Bear. I'm afraid they won't. Anyway, from this moment on, you just watch me. I will be on that canoe, and no one will ever get me off it. <sighs> it's hopeless. We could cut the tree higher up. Once the insects are in the wood, the whole tree is weak. The mast would shatter at the first gust of wind. Come on, we'll just find another mast. This one was growing right beside the worksite. It made it easy to carry down, but the others... Hey, you got Bacor to leave. You won't get stuck here by just a tree. We'll find something. You have to get your dog out of the canoe. He's in the way and he won't move. Ursus. Ursus? <laughs> nice job, Ursus. Ha! Did you see that? I didn't fall! I think I'm finding my sea legs. Daro! The mast! I know what to do about the mast! <laughs> I'm telling you, this trunk is no good. It's too flexible. Exactly. That's just what we need. Come on, let's get it on the logs. Ah! Ooh. This tree belongs to us, does it? <laughs> Tell me. How do you know wolf trees from cave dweller trees? Do you mark them the way dogs do? He's gone, Octar. But don't worry. Now they have no mast. They won't be going anywhere. The mast! You were right, it was too flexible. Well? Hmm. But the mast. So that was all just a ruse to fool the wolves? You could have told us. Don't be angry, Bog. It had to look real. the net! The net! Hand me the net! And I suppose, as usual, I'm the one who has to tell Enoch. You are definitely a most remarkable man. Without you, we wouldn't have a canoe. I did not do it alone. Just ask the blisters on their hands. <laughs> Go, my little beast. Ancestors, my... my spirit is torn. If we leave, the tribe will survive. But the land you paid for with your lives will belong to the wolves. I must choose between life and honor. I... I need your guidance. Please, answer me. If I am wrong to leave, speak! Send me a sign! work together to make a net that will span the river. Their canoe must not pass. But this is nonsense. The cave dwellers are leaving at last. That is what we want. Why should we hold them back? They shall not leave before giving us Noama and Rahan. 
I am your chief. I will not be questioned. Those are the words of a lone wolf. Enoch's war brings nothing to our pack. I will not stop the cave dwellers. Can you blame them for wanting to leave this blood-soaked earth behind? Is it so wrong to... Any other traitors got something they'd like to say? I didn't think so. Get to work. Is there a reason I can't get you off this canoe? The clouds. They told Tetra that I wouldn't be on the boat. Oh, and you believe them? No, not the clouds. But Tetra, well, she is a shaman. So I'm staying right here no matter what. You're not leaving me behind. You crazy fool. This canoe, this is just proof that men make their own destiny, not clouds. But I'm not a man, I'm a bear. You're not a bear, you're just a cuckoo. Oh, by the way, the cave dwellers are roasting a deer tonight to celebrate their departure. But if you'd rather watch the clouds... Oh. Thank you, Anka. Bakor won't join us? Everyone is preparing to leave in his own way. I'm bringing a handful of earth from the Great Valley, along with those most precious to me. Your paintbrushes, you mean? This is the hut where I raised my little ones. You expect me to leave it for some wolf to nest in? <laughs> Life or honor, why must everything be so complicated? Uh... What? Hurry! I want that net in place before daylight. A chief who strikes down his own hunters doesn't deserve respect. I hope the canoe gets past. And if I thought they would bring me with them, I'd be the first... You again. The rudder is almost in position. Hmm. must stay and fight in their honor. <laughs> These people want to live, not fight. Do not deprive them of hope. I won't listen to you anymore. Out of my way. <laughs> You are all cowards! Ah! Oh! Ah! Look out! Up ahead! Wolves! It's the wolves! Get on board! We're all dead! Push them back! Rahan! Take 
with you! Take, Take us, us with, with you. you! Kill those traitors! But they're wolves! And I am your chief! Kill them! No, no Wanna! Throw us a rope! We're coming with you! Rahan! Where's Rahan? Okay, okay! I just got beaten up underwater. You really think hitting me is gonna make me feel better? See? See? See what? The clouds, you moron! The clouds! It was written up in the sky! What a mess!